Okay, first I swung with the Easton Ghost Double Barrel. Um, I wasn't crazy about the sound, but I like the one piece feel, so um, I liked the way that it felt in my hands. Just wasn't crazy about the sound coming off my bat. But I feel like this could work for any type of hitter, maybe a little more power hitter, um, but it really just depends on preference wise if you like flex versus no flex. Very even loaded bat, um, very balanced. Um, I personally like a little bit of an end loaded bat, so that was not something that I loved, but it did feel great coming off the barrel. There was a little bit of give if you didn't hit it straight um, directly on the sweet spot, which is always nice to have, especially when you're a slapper and you sometimes don't hit the ball perfectly, but sometimes that's the goal. But again, pretty solid, pretty, um, I would recommend this a little bit more for a power hitter than somebody who's gonna do a little bit more short game. Um, just for that balanced, kind of strong, no, no flex feel. Um, we swung a 34 drop nine. Personally, I do like having that drop nine feel so I can get a little bit more um, umph on my balls. I, I really like that feel. Um, but this bat actually was a little bit more evenly distributed, which was a, was a surprise. Um, I would definitely recommend this bat to a power hitter because I feel like if you square it up, it feels awesome. If you don't square it up, you can kind of feel it a little bit. And as a slapper, sometimes I am uh, looking to not square the ball up. I personally really prefer Easton's. That's what I swing here at the pro level. Um, I found that um, even I give lessons back home, all my lessons love this bat. I personally love this bat. Out of the wrapper, there's always a ton of pop. You can be late or early. You can miss hit a ball and still get a good swing on this bat. Um, so I really prefer this Easton bat. I actually really like using Easton. Um, I started using it this summer a lot. And for me, I'm really big on feel. And this bat feels super even to me. And um, I feel like I get a lot of good barrels on this. Um, like I said, gap to gap hitter. So um, if there's a ball a little bit too far outside and I poke at it, I always feel like it gets in the gap. So I really enjoy using this Easton. It's the first bat I swung today. I really liked it. It was easy to swing, didn't sting my hands, um, had good pop on the ball. I would recommend this for a power hitter. I think all Eastons come out of the wrapper a little bit hotter than some other bats. So um, you can't go wrong with a ghost.